a sphere of plasticine of radius 8 centimeters is reduced to a cube. So now this is a sphere. This is a plasticine sphere of radius 8 centimeters. Now what you do is, from this you are going to make a, a sphere. Sorry, from, a, uh, from the sphere you are going to make a cube. Okay, the cube. And you want to find the what's the length of this cube to the nearest millimeter. You want to find what's the side length in nearest millimeter. So one thing that you have to understand for this type of question is the volume of the sphere the volume of sphere is equal to the volume of cube. That's the basic idea. The volume of sphere is equal because it's the same quantity, the same volume that made the sphere is making the cube. So you can say the volume of sphere is equal to the volume of cube. Okay, so hopefully you know the volume, the formula for volume of cube and sphere. So volume of sphere a uh, sphere is 4 times 4 times pi times radius cube divided by 3 and the volume of a uh, uh, sorry volume of cube i should have written here not sphere volume of cube volume of uh, sphere is equal to the volume of cube and the length the length is so let's call this say x or let's call this l so the volume of a cube would be l cube so l times l times l the volume of a sphere is equal to the volume of cube so i've just written the formula so now we can apply substitute the value so you can say 4 times pi times 8 cube divided by 3 is equal to L cube. Okay, so this is, let's uh, use the calculator to find this. So this is 4 times shift pi times 8 cube divided by 3, which is equal to 2144.66. So let me write that 2144. 0.66 centimeter cube is equal to L cube. Now, if you want to find L from L cube, what would you do? So let me write this again. So L cube is 2144.66. Now to undo this cube, you have to take the cube root. So you have to take the cube root of this side. So you have to take the cube root of this number. So cube and cube root and cube cancel each other out. So what is remaining is L is cube root of this. So how do you find this? So you can go like this. So press shift. And that is, in some calculators, you directly have the cube root key. So you know, before that, you press 3 shift cube root so this means cube root of whatever number so it is 2144 point i hope i can't see the point here this is 0. 0.66 equal 12.89 okay so this is about 12.89 so you can't have you can't round it up so i'll say because this cannot be rounded up. You have to round down. So I'll say the maximum that you can make is of 12 centimeters. So this is 12. So yeah, yeah you can, so you can change this into millimeters. So let me write 12.89 centimeters, which is in 2 dp. This is centimeters in 2 dp. And so if you want to change this into millimeter, it's 128 uh, millimeters. I can say this is 128 or one, 129. I would say 128 millimeter can be the length of the cube.